also on the programme, One Couple's Property Nightmare. It's heartbreaking at times. Uh, we've, we've really gone through hell and high water to try and get someone to talk to us. A mortgage on a house they can't move into. A couple today spoke of their nightmare of paying a large mortgage but still not being able to live in the house they bought. Friends and family came out to show their support today at a protest in County Clare. There's a lot of people with unfinished estates in this country and no one is helping them. An emotional Michelle Burke addressing a protest outside the dream home she and her husband can't access. They bought the house in the Ardna Derrica estate in Killaloo County, Clare in 2006. But the developer ran into financial trouble and the estate was locked up. We are now here today because we're paying a mortgage every month on a house that we can't get into and the main reason we can't get into that is we have no services. It's, it's heartbreaking at times. Uh, we've, we've really gone through hell and high water to try and get someone to talk to us. They pay €1,400 Euro a month for their mortgage and rent. For a number of years they rented across the road from the ghost estate. But unfortunately it became very hard to drive every day past the estate. So uh, we made a decision there two years ago uh, to move. We also had bought um, furniture um, from in the UK and they had held on to it for four years for us. And so we were under pressure to uh, to bring over the furniture and rent a house so we've done that. John Ryan and his son are in the same position. My son had his electricity turned on, his gas turned on and uh, that week they closed and put a, the bank came in with a receiver and put a, a lock on the whole property. I had my house sold for 315,000 at the time and I was moving out here and I suppose my house is probably worth about 170 or 80,000 now give or take I'm not sure. They want Clare County Council to call in the planning insurance bond to connect the service. Clare County Council has agreed to meet with the three owners over the next few days. They say if they don't get what they want, they will continue their protest outside the council offices next week. Diane Connor, the 530 Killaloo County Clare.